Aloha everybody. How are we going? It's cracker of a day for it. Not really, it's bloody shit ass outside. But anyway, <laughs> some of the stuff we got to sell this week. Cool old fifty dollar notes there. Johnson Fraser signature combinations. Beautiful little miniature padlock. This is a really cool little submarine, little die cast model of a submarine which has got on the side um I think it's actually made out of a piece from the little Japanese midget sub that was sunk in Sydney Harbour. Little writing on the side of it, great little thing. There'll be better pictures of it on the website. It's pretty cool, little Indian motorcycle key keychain there with a little original leather straplet made by the Bastion Brothers. Got a little mark on the back. Nice big chunky silver bracelets. Nice little gold seed pearl brooch or pendant over the back there. A pair of little gold stud earrings as well. And there's some other nice things. Nice little footy badge there of Chook. Chook Howl or something like that from Carlton. He's pretty cool. A little boomerang miniature harmonica. Cigarette packets. Big tin of coins over the back. Nice little pineapple. <laughs> Just a little sort of replica of a little pineapple hand grenade. That's pretty cool. Sterling silver napkin ring. Nice big sterling silver cigarette case there. Some medallions for VFL Park, a little Mattel Speed Freak handheld game. Lots of nice little bits of jewellery, banknotes, coins and stuff in the jewellery cabinet this week. Now what other gear have we got? A little cabinet, pretty cute, a nice industrial juicer, the big brass artillery shell. It's pretty cool, a sort of uh, oriental lacquered chair, nice little oriental uh, red painted trunk there. My bloody cup of coffee's not for sale though. Pretty cool, little industrial shelf, little two shelves on the inside, box of the books and casters. It's fantastic, the sort of work, the Shell Workman shirt. Original sewn on shell badge on the right there, original label on the shirt. More nice box, lots of sort of tools, heaps of tools again this week and pottery. Nice big lot of EPNS in there and heaps of watches in that box. Heaps of cool stuff in the box lot area. Some ram set tools down the bottom there. Fantastic old uh, rotor picnic esky. He's in great original condition. Sort of cool old kitchen alien and some nice books. The girls' own annuals are all in great condition. There's some lovely pictures by Harrison Fisher throughout. Big lot of footy cards. Interesting lot of books. All different types in amongst. And playing cards and stamps and records and more stamps. Nice little oil bottle with the metal funnel over the back there. Pretty cool. The old sort of fans off a Kenworth truck. Sid Chrome tools. Ephemera. This thing's funny. Ticker print. Funny little machine thing. Some more tools and first day covers. Heaps more footy cards down the bottom there as well. It's actually a nice little lot of sort of baby's baths, bits and bobs. I like the little stool there. He's a little ripper. Got some nice paintings this week. The Gunnar Names is quite a nice little sort of abstract one. Reminds me of Antarctica or something like that. Signed and dated 1993. It's a bit of a surprise. I sort of expected it to be 73, but anyway, it's a cool little thing. This is nice. The big Frank Carter oil painting there of the little workman on his way home with his horse and cart all full, full up with wood. The Gavin Burt oil's quite nice, lovely colours, a bit different. Like the big Stella Saper, uh, boats at Morty Ellet Creek or something like that. She's a George Bell School artist. Nice thing. The Max Nicholson's really nice, sort of Australian landscape. There's some little emus in there and a little sort of homestead. Some other bits and bobs. I don't like this little sort of portrait, little European school portrait of a soldier there. It's painted on Hessian. So I've got a funny feeling it's painted during the war. They've just sort of found whatever materials they can to use to paint on. And he's pretty cool. A little watercolour there. Oh, what is it? A pouting pygmy pigeon or something like that. It's got feathers on its feet. Kind of handy in this kind of weather. <laughs> Big fish bowl full of matchboxes. A couple of bits of the Berlin Wall. A couple of bottles of plonk. I've got some more nice kitchen alia and Australian pottery and stuff. Some more nice stamps and some footy cards. A lot of shaving mugs. The book on tattoo art's pretty cool. Really like the cover by Jill Del Mace. 
Yeah, some good toys, New Zealand sort of mint uncut sheet of pre-decimal stamps, more stamps next to it. Coca-Cola sort of trucks and cars and money boxes and Tonka stuff. Playing cards and more Australian pottery down the bottom. There's some cool stuff this week, guys. Nice pair of sort of decorative fencing sort of sword things. Nice little bits of glass, a little black sort of compact handbag purse thing made in France. The lovely bit, we've put it with a nice bit of art glass. Yeah, some nice bits of china and pottery and stuff. More playing cards. Lovely little parasols. Little model kit. Couple of packets of unopened card from Nugget Casino in Vegas. Some guitar pedals. Little Boomeroo tin toy. Yeah, there's heaps of nice stuff this week. Pretty cool. The old Support the Pies tin sign down the bottom there with a signed picture of Buckley. Old side cash boxes are nice. Heaps of pretty china and stuff. Old Omo box. And in the end cabinet, it's looking pretty cool as well this week, actually. Little red gramophone down the bottom's nice. Red ones always go faster. We've got oil lamps and little kerosene heaters and stuff. Um, all sort of cigarette cards. Nice little collection of stamps in there. They're pretty cool. A vacuum oil. Little bowls and plates out of an old service station or something. A couple of nice reference books on Australian petrol, petrol pump stuff. Nice little photograph there of the Shell truck. Australian pre-decimal stamps over the back. Big group lot of them. There's some lovely mint ones in amongst. More nice sort of uh, cigarette cards. World War One sort of stuff. And some nice guy at the top. The old sort of French kepi military hat. A couple of really pretty little bits of Royal Winton there with a spider web. Some nice Beswick jugs there. Nice, another little Sylvia Halpern bird. I think we had one in last week or the week before. This is another one. Nice little bit there of Tacax. I oh, like the little brownie downing. A little great little bit little kid there riding on the little turtle with a bobbing head and tail. Nice pair of classical royal ducks. These are really nice, these. Little twin pack of playing cards there featuring Melbourne. This will be the place for a village and the other one's just a scene of Melbourne. Got their original little sort of scoring pens in there and everything. Just a great little lot. Great little lot. Anyway, hope you saw something you liked. But you know me, I don't really care if you didn't. <laughs> Have a good one.